I hope they would notice a little earlier than that. <laughs> from, my, from my experience, it's mostly ow, ow, <laughs> ow. Welcome back to Carpe GM Does Gaming. We're playing Noobs and Masterminds, 3rd edition, in today's modern world. <laughs> with some minor modifications. We last left our heroes, they were in a casino. Or fleeing a casino that they destroyed a room in. Did we destroy the room? We didn't destroy Patriot it. Patriot did. No. <laughs> yeah. Patriot? Sorry, maybe a little. <laughs> eh. That's debatable. Somebody Body mas <laughs> masturbating <laughs> onto every surface. Okay, yeah. It's like, give me a free room, will you? <laughs> yeah, this is a high roller. I'm high rolling all over the place, motherfucker. Yeah! How could you take? That's like a gallon. Seriously. That's what that is. <laughs> great American He's spirit everywhere. super soldier serum everywhere. <laughs> uh, so are... Uh, strong swimmers. So our heroes have been uh, coming to terms with their new roles in their life, or at least trying to maybe figure out what those roles are. Let's be clear. We're, we become misanthropes. Yeah, we're, we're, doing, we're doing a bad job at this. We've been, so far, the skills that um, Arc Force has learned is how to carefully manipulate casino uh, slot machines to make minor payouts. Not a lot, just minor payouts. Enough um, to keep the lights on. Yeah, enough to keep the lights on. Um, the Reverend has... Uh, Revenant. Revenant. Yeah, Reverend. <laughs> Irrelevant. Reverend. Revenant. Revenant has <laughs> learned how to fuck up uh, blackjack wheels so that we win. <laughs> roulette. Roulette. Excuse me, roulette. Roulette. I just woke up. Uh, Patriot has learned how to spooge all over a room, and uh, so, and Doctor Utah has hopefully learned the difference between men and women finally. Hey, hey, hey! Well, they're not dinosaurs. Gender identity is a very fluid subject, and the prostitute portrayed herself as female. Therefore, she was female. Apparently so. <clears throat> all right. Seriously, Patriot must have been watching you and your transgender person, and that's why he was <laughs> coating every surface <laughs> with super serum. <laughs> Close circuit TV, just for the high rollers. <laughs> if I get a, if I get an injection of super soldier serum, will I get superpowers? You'll get super something. <laughs> super pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> super sticky. We've never oh, seen 13, 13 embryos growing in a womb before. <laughs> Today, Louis, every woman in the entire casino building impregnated. <laughs> even the ones that didn't have sex. <laughs> yeah. The poor, the poor cleaning staff's like, got the mop out. Thunk! <laughs> no! <laughs> this is strange. I never feel sick in the morning. <laughs> Racist. <laughs> that just happened. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no. You pray. You pray. <laughs> I need more lemon pledge. <laughs> no, no. no. <laughs> lemon penisol. <laughs> penisol. That's, anyway. that's how I say it. <laughs> oh. Alright. So, after some uh, quick retrospec retrospection and a bagel in the. Uh, Hotel lobby, uh, you guys get back in your vehicle and drive away from the casino. <laughs> don't don't do my normal uh, aerial tailing of uh, of the vehicle. Sitting in the back like this. We should never have come here. Despondent. 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 You know what despondent means. I know. I said despondent though, because I was making a bad joke. That is a really bad joke. Yes. It's like illogical. Oh, uh, there we go. Sensible. As long as you guys are clear on that. Okay. All right. Okay, so I should be uh, eventually receiving some updated characters. No feel, feel free to update mine. I just added uh, one to my stamina. Okay. That I can do. 
because it's it's uh, proven that I can be damaged, so I should probably have some ability to uh, you know resist damage. <laughs> what happens? Okay, I am done. I can't figure out a way to change my electrical control over out of from saying move object. I don't want to have the intention to move object with it. I want to be able to affect electrical systems. It just says move object. And if I would, so I'm just going to say that it doesn't mean move object. It means powering and unpowering electrical devices. And then I will figure it out today while we sit around here. So I'm just going to send you my character. Okay. It's only come into a play once where it is a flash drive. Put it in the Dropbox. Screw all of you and your goddamn Dropbox. Oh man, I thought I was past these crashes. You're never past the crashes because the Chinese won't let you be, Moz. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing Chinese in this laptop. Not racist. <laughs> <laughs> That's not racist. I'm pointing out that most likely. That's what I said. Not racist. <laughs> he could have blamed it on the Russians. Da, 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 da. Spacious. Definitely could have blamed on the Russians. There's nothing Chinese in this. Okay, the Russians. The Russians won't let you get past it. Actually, it may have all been uh, made in China for all I know. I mean, it is a laptop. It's just branded with an American company's name. It's Taiwanese. Oh, yeah. That's where the motherboard manufacturer is. For at least the motherboard. Every other component's probably made in China. The motherboard. The board of mothers. The motherland, the motherboard, yeah. Very Russian. Anyway... <laughs> oh, there's the latest version of Arc Force. I finally can understand Wi Fi. My lifelong goal. Ooh. Okay. Analytical, I think, was the one I was missing. So I have accurate and analytical and everything else attached to my hearing so that I can finally go, Yes, I can read Wi Fi! Wait, wait, I can't transmit anything! This is next to worthless still for browsing the internet. I can only browse the internet of what Yachter Utah is browsing the internet. And he looks up old dino porn and transgender stuff. <laughs> and transgender dinosaur porn. I don't care what a cisgender velociraptor even looks like. <laughs> the same as a transgender velociraptor? One would think, but one would be wrong. <laughs> That's Mrs. Dr. Utah to you. Ah! <laughs> I'm, as a human, I'm male. As a velociraptor, I'm fabulous. Growl. <laughs> zap, 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 zap. Oh. I'm still operating off of the same paper character sheets, and I just remembered that I took that uh, possession type power. I should probably note somewhere. Cloaca possession? Yes. That's the wrong document. Oh, that's weird. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, well, there I'm ready, so I'm sitting in the back of the car. So you guys have. Uh, we're headed to Syracuse. That was the. You had been your end goal for a couple times. Things still got, is. Things got weird. It's up to you if it still is. Uh, you had also talked about going to Pittsburgh mm. to, to do hero heroing stuff. We're going to drive through Pittsburgh anyway. Because as we all know, you know, Pittsburgh is the lowliest, horrible... This is a sunny day in Pittsburgh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a terrible place to be. Everyone hates it. All right. We're going to go to Holy Pittsburgh shit. to stop and eat. And we will see if there's any hero working to be done there. And if there isn't, we will persist on to Sarah Cruz. Uh, Sarah whatever, Cruz? Whatever the fuck. I'll be sure to park the truck Sarah next to a uh, phone booth. <laughs> so we all change into our superior <laughs> uniforms. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see the extended version of that trailer? Uh, funniest part of the movie, yeah. though. Yeah. Hold it, Stan Lee! Keep running. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was fantastic. Yep. It lays down with a dead body. Yeah. No, heart to heart. Anyway. <clears throat> Saw Logan. That was depressing as hell. Great, but depressing as hell. Ah, that's what that feels like. Mm. Alright. Maybe you go with Nazi. Let's see that. Um, 
I didn't really change much of the character. I even equipment that I already kind of had, like camo clothing and restraints and multi tools. Restraints. Um, well, the zip ties I've been using. In, mm, if you look in the so videos, the highlights and stuff, uh, whatever the last one is, you can just add plus one to. You know, I was thinking, Patriot. The restraints you've been using, the ones that that one person got out of, like really super easy. We might want to invest in some better quality restraints. Or mm -hmm. duct tape. Yeah, well, we'll just duct. Next time we capture these, somebody, these usually work pretty well. Well, come here. Let me test them out. Okay. All right. Put your hands behind your back. Yeah. I'll just melt them off zip, when I shoot lightning zip. bolts out of my. Sword. All right. Well, don't use the lightning bolts. Just see if you can wiggle out of them. That doesn't mean anything to me. I can't wiggle normally. <laughs> hey. Well, so you're a normal person, sort of. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> they melt on me. Looks like plits of plastic. Oh, great. Now I'm ingesting bits of plastic. Now I'm going to have black poops. Well, belly button poops. <laughs> Racist. <laughs> well, uh, there's one thing that I was uh, <clears throat> going to bring up eventually. It might help in taking somebody prisoner, especially if we're trying to be sneaky about it. Uh, hey, buddy, uh, mind if I borrow you for a second? Sure. Okay. No force fields. This is going to feel weird. Disappear into him. Okay, I don't ever turn my force field off, so he <laughs> kind of bounces off. <laughs> Ding. What the hell, man? you got to relax for a second. Okay. I deactivate my force shield and immediately I get, like, super, like, I would say, pear-shaped. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird, but okay. <laughs> Disappear into him. Hey, I'm Arc Force, and apparently I'm a fat guy. <laughs> I started, like, looking all melty. Oh, <laughs> this might be a bad thing. But you see what I'm talking about, right? I believe he's having a seizure. <laughs> <laughs> jump, jump out of him. Hey, what the hell, man? It's more like a stroke. The one side of his face started to, like, <laughs> Crap. <laughs> I, like, start slowly pushing myself back to my normal shape. Sorry, I want to demonstrate on one of them, but, you know, uh, I've known you longer. Woo. I noticed that the last time I was grabbing a guy, it was like I could uh, sort of feel him. Oh. But uh, I don't get none of the brain stuff. Like, I couldn't read your brain. I don't think I could do your powers if I wanted to. Oh, that's probably for the best. You all right? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. What the... Like, a minute later, I'm back to normal. <laughs> wow. If only everybody could get rid of a gut like that. Oh, yeah. It's fun. <coughs> it's not so much I get fatter. It's all of the weight starts heading down. I'm pretty sure if I turn my force shield off long term, I turn into a pancake on the ground. Eh, well, that's gross. Yeah. Anyway, y you see, if we, if we just got one person that we need to capture, I can do that. So if we see Janet again, we've got a plan. Well, it wasn't, it, Janet. It, it wasn't Janet last time. Of course, that one's dead. But yeah, I could just sort of take her over. And, mm. uh, I mean, it still wouldn't help us too much. We have to get her get a someplace. Uh, well, if they're dead, can you still take them over? Like, just, just move them around? Yeah, I haven't tried that. Uh, it well, might come into play. <laughs> given how heroic we've been so far, let's hit a morgue. <laughs> I am being not facetious, you assholes. We're not going to a morgue. Yeah, I mean, we could just do a drive-by on somebody. How long do they have to be dead for? This is no, man. I don't know. <laughs> Shit. Well, from my medical knowledge, I mean, if we revive them within five minutes, we're not actually killing them. Well, the last guy... Wow. Guys, <laughs> the last person that you guys captured turned into a, literally a puddle of human goo. What happens if you turn into a puddle of human goo while possessing somebody? I don't know. I mean, I'm, I wasn't really Arc Force. I, I just sort of had his body, you know, control well, of his I'm body. assuming the body would blow away and he would still be standing there like, Alright. Yeah, <laughs> like, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm in substantial. Who's driving right now? I'm in substantial when, uh, when I'm inside of somebody, you know? You're driving. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't driven in years. This is all sorts of fun. He just possessed me, too. <laughs> wow. What was I thinking? Anyway. I was restraining you while you were driving. Here <laughs> 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 you're, you're, you're in the seat like... <laughs> <laughs> He's coordinated enough to do that. Uh, 
No, keep going faster. My foot is melting. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyway, it, it'll be fine. Unless somebody asks me a question, the person I'm grabbed onto is no. Uh, you know, I had to talk. Um, I'm not sure if I can replicate anybody's voice. You know? Yeah, you're terrible voices. Yeah, wait, 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 I think I sound okay. You have a very distinct accent. Yes. Well, I mean, you know, I, I don't know. All right, nine months ago, we stole the communicator off the guard. They started asking, you're like, oh, yeah, everything's okay, yeah. We're okay, yeah. We're okay, yeah. The guy was Chinese. So I should have said, like, hi? Uh. Was that, uh, was that uh, wait, is that Chinese? <laughs> Close enough. Yeah, oh. raptor's not on the window. What the hell? Stop turning into a raptor in the motherfucking car. Well, it's the biggest mouth I can sneeze with. Well, there's one bigger, but I try not to use that one anymore. You're not allowed to be a T-Rex <laughs> anymore. <laughs> Never again. Everyone starts screaming Godzilla, and then suddenly you're there, and it's just not good. Good job with the death chicken, though. Now, if you just find some way to split into a bunch of them, that'd be sweet. I'll work on that. Hmm. Death chickens. <laughs> wow. You know, we keep getting more and more depressing, and I just don't understand why. Ah, damn it. Mm. Okay. <laughs> hey, yeah, I was losing myself at the moment enjoying the conversation, but thanks for bringing me back to reality, asshole. So. All right, so you guys are, uh, mm -hmm. you guys, um, everybody make a... Uh, uh, Intellect or something that would reference uh, uh, American geography. We've been going the wrong way. <laughs> no, no. This I'm is not stupid enough to go the wrong way. So inside in Ohio. No, none of you have ever been to Pittsburgh. Your characters have been there, but you all know what you all heard about it. Perception. No. Eh. No, just intellect. I make a four by four. Four. Eleven. Total. 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 Okay. Eleven. Eighteen. Eight. Nineteen. Nineteen. Eight. Okay, so you knows yours was eleven? Okay. So I rolled like crap and I have so, plus four. So Patriot and Arc Force, you guys basically, the only thing you've ever heard and you may as well basically believe is that it looks like it looks like that on a good day. There's soot in the air, there's shit everywhere. They got a football team. They, get, they, uh, they do, but they're mostly criminals. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Blasphemy! <laughs> Racist! <laughs> uh, you two have uh, both know that, like, you know, there's probably not soot in the air, but it is a dirty town because there's, it's, you know, been a steel, it's been a steel producing area for, you know, 100 years. And so it's not known for being a clean area. It's not necessarily a high-income area. There's little parts here and there, but just like any other city. But compared to most other cities, it's kind of dirty. It's kind of like uh, kind of like New York before, you know, Giuliani and stuff. I thought they stopped making steel here due to the whole they don't make steel anymore. The Americans make steel, I think. I don't want to make just not very much of it. No, all I want is some Iron City beer. It tastes like shit, but it's from Pittsburgh. That's their slogan. I don't, I don't know what it actually tastes. <laughs> you, how will you know? You taste nothing. I want to try to fit in with other people. Look, I want to go to eat other... Look, last time I couldn't eat anything, I tasted anything. We had a ghost pepper eating contest. I won you 80 bucks. I don't want to hear about it. I want some beer. I don't appreciate 80 bucks. Anyway. So... You guys, uh, so you guys drive for a while, and you're not, Pittsburgh's not ridiculously far from where you guys were. About three hours. Uh, it's a pretty, uh, uneventful drive. Uh, the road between there here and there is very, uh, it's tree-lined, scenic, if you like, you know, nature. You pass a couple small towns, but you eventually get there. Hmm. There's the northern route, which is through the woods, and the southern route, which is by the strip clubs. Take your pick. <laughs> strip clubs, you say? You know, the great thing about being invisible in a strip club, you don't got to pay for shit. So I take the northern route. <laughs> so as you approach the city, um, you guys see an odd sight. 
and it'll eventually come up. The city's clean and pretty. What mm. the shit is all this? There's no clouds in the sky. It's nice. Why is that building yellow? It's like it's, it's like bright first thing in the morning yellow piss color. I think that's the art museum. They have an Andy Warhol mm. museum in, in Pittsburgh. It's really the neat. Red building? Yeah, that... that. What building? Oh, there's an arts district, rather. Wait, that four-poster building right there, I think... No, wait, one of those two buildings in the middle is the PNC building, and I'm trying to remember which one it is. I think it's the one with the four... The four uh, You're out of character right now. ...things on top. Okay. Do you know? They got a few now, apparently. Um, Minus 30 experience. To bring up PNC. <laughs> <laughs> Douche nozzle. Anyway... Man, this is something. It's absolutely nothing like you've heard. No. Uh, well, guess we'll have to take shifts watching the car. Yep. All right, let's drive through the middle of the downtown section so we can get a better feel for it. Don't worry, we've got GPS navigation. I'm sure that won't fail when we hit the middle of the downtown part of the city. Um, maybe we should wash our car because this is way too clean for us. <laughs> True. All right, I drive through a car wash. One of the um. We go to the gas station with a car wash. Now. Sure, you get off off the uh, interstate and you pull into some area and looking around and like there's not like not even a, like you're looking around and again it looks like real clean, mm. looks nice. Like even on like where the uh, side of the roads goes into the storm drains, it almost looks like it's just been recently like a street sweeper has come through. Oh, nice! This is like stupid clean. This is this is like unrealistic. City of the future, you know. So bullshit. Well, you find it easily find a gas station. Um, <coughs> uh, you pull in and you're. Is there traffic? There's there's a there's a little bit of traffic, but it's nothing. It's nothing annoying. Yeah. This place is nice. So you pull in and you uh, pay for your uh, car wash. You go in there and um, who who's uh. I guess it would just be one of those slide machines. No, I'm gonna go, I think we're going to go into the station anyway just to get a feel for it. So. Okay. Who's going in? Uh, All right. Two of us will go in. You guys can pump the gas. <coughs> we will take a, take a piss. Uh, you want to pump the gas? I mean, you're pretty good at pumping. <laughs> sure. <laughs> you going in as you or are you an invisible, <laughs> unaudible person? Well, I remember I don't have an audibility. Anymore. Okay. Well, yeah. That was trying. That was me trying to be nice. Um, no, I'm just, I'm just me. I'm just a guy. Okay. I walk in too. All right. There's a person behind the counter. Um, it's like a Asian person. Racist. Shh. No, descriptive. Guy, <laughs> guy, Colin. Um, he can greet you. going out. Oh, th- th- thanks for coming in. Yeah. Salutations, Haas. Yeah. Uh, my bros are just, uh, you know. Cleaning the old uh, chariot. I uh, thought we'd come in, make use of the facilities. Sure, sure. The uh, restrooms are right over there, and uh, feel free to shop around and uh, pick up anything you need. Make a perception check. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, you can make one too. You're in there. Perception. 23. Not that. <laughs> uh, 14. Um, yeah. Uh, Everything seems fine to you, Buzz. Ryan, you think just for like a like a split second you saw something like crawl under his shirt collar. <laughs> but there's no like but there's no like bulge or anything like something's moving around or I mean there's no it just his shirt just looks normal. But you just like you know <laughs> sometimes you catch something on the corner of your eye and you're like what the fuck? Whatever. No. Okay, well, that's <coughs> interesting. Um, I'm still listening for any weird radio traffic. Uh, I go and drain the belly button. <laughs> they should be consistent. All right, it's so <laughs> fucking weird. Okay. It opens up a small hole in the force field. It just starts draining. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot, I didn't get all those eggs from, yesterday, from this morning. <laughs> God, I you should use the toilet. <laughs> not not ready for Marvel movie superhero. <laughs> <laughs> You're not even. You, you don't even have to since you have the now the compression factor with your. <laughs> yeah, here we go. 
It's a stream by the time I'm done. It's been boiling for like Uh-oh, a long time. Uh-oh, momentary clog. <laughs> oh, God, I don't want to have to clean this stuff. Yeah, so, the wall. <laughs> well, it's the, well, see, it's what they think. You know, They think they have to clean it up because someone was being mean. No, no, belly button explosion is bad. Yeah, it's great. I walk back out. Oh, wow. Normal people don't talk when they're taking a piss. Just so you know. Hey, nice watch. <laughs> <laughs> Liver. Anyway, <laughs> uh, I walk over. I, I liver. Since I slap found that, I decide I go over and grab some jerky and some um, a, a large soda, one of the gallon buckets of soda. Okay. Oh. Pail of. Uh, you're, you, I see you guys have mediums. Do you have any large pails? It's the. Well, you have the. That's the super mega gulp. That's the biggest one. Okay. Shelf. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, and yeah, that's what ninety-seven cents for a mega dr- bucket full of soda, and then uh, do you have one of the uh, rewards cards? Uh, no, I don't. I guess I could sign up for one. Yeah, sure. This is a uh, sure. Just um, this is uh, what, go ahead and uh, he gets your what's your name? Uh, Orlando. <laughs> Orlando. And last name? What the hell was my last name? I haven't used it in forever. Well, the government's still tracking Room. us. Orlando, Orlando Room. There you go. <laughs> Jackson, <laughs> unless you're trying to yeah, fake him. Him. Okay. Fake. He's like, fair enough. And he goes, okay. And he uh, grabs a thing from behind. Looks like he plugs it in. Slides it up. He's like, just do your thumb print right there and you'll be good to go. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'll give it a try, but my thumb was horribly damaged in the war. I don't have a thumb print. <laughs> there's a perfectly smooth surface on there. Yeah, the... Trick. Nothing could read my thumbprint after the accident. Mm-hmm. I could try with the other thumb, but it doesn't. It does the exact same. Well, thing. you go to our company's website and sign up. So oh. somehow that way. So. Oh, but no. this time, yeah, it's going to be nine nine ninety seven cents plus tax. Oh, oh. God. that's horrible. But okay, that's fine. I, I pull up five bucks and pay for it. I, I'm spending. The, I'm really spending the whole time talking to him, trying to see if I can see what's under his shirt. I'm just making it last as long as I possibly okay. can. Yeah, well, I'm poking around because I'm still suspicious about the fucking city oh. looking like that. Oh, wait a second. Uh, he can just, just investigate him. or whatever. Yeah. Oh, there's something crawled under his. Sh- okay. Uh, 14, yeah. Fourteen twenty twenty one, just to investigate, like just pawing through all the stuff, looking for local magazine, newspapers, whatever. Okay. Um, Let's try to peruse. Sure. There's there's the, the the Pittsburgh Herald and. Uh, yeah. Oh, I, I buy a newspaper too. Ooh, you guys still have newspapers? And there's still there's a couple other. Uh, Papers there, but they're maybe like three at the most. Uh, I, I grab all of them. Oh, we've been here forever, my oh, friend. Oh, really right, yeah, let's uh, put the one I had back. Yeah, that, 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 good idea. Let's, let's yeah. just uh, make sure we got all the information since we're in town. Excellent. Well, oh. great. Uh, looks like they've uh, finished pumping the gas there. And, oh, uh, thanks a lot. We'll be out now. They prepaid and uh, right. could make one more perception check if you like. All right. 25. 16. Notice anything else oh, after cool. that? So they step out. Okay, I need you to go invisible as soon as I get my truck fly back in there and find out what the hell is under his collar because there's like a bug or something on him, like a large insect. Okay. All right, we're going to drive. So I get back and they go, Patriot, why don't we drive around the block a couple times until he gets back in the car? <laughs> okay. Here I go. Cow. Just disappear. All right. I'll just float in. Did you ask about the city? Why is it so clean? Yeah, there's. I I saw an alien bug of some type, or some sort of weird bug crawling on the guy. So I'm very. Here's two. Here's three newspapers. I give them all to Doctor Utah. Start reading and figuring this stuff out. I'm just gonna sit here and. So sure, just was on a cockroach because you know. It was climbing on his collar. Like, I could see a cockroach on the ground, not in that location, but I could. This one was crawling on the guy's neck, like, here. And he, like, he, he, didn't, he didn't react like there I was anything on him at all. He didn't react at all to it. Like, if there's a cockroach on anybody, they're going to smash it or something, if it's just... Cr- so, sort of, maybe. I might be wrong. Wraith will go... You're not yeah, here, right? Yeah. That Wraith will go look for it, okay. so we'll be fine. So, yeah. yeah when anyway. I was in uh, Zanesville, we had a lady come into the branch. She had, like, you know, a coat on. And when she was doing her... Tell her stuff like cockroaches kept falling off of her. 
Oh, that's horrific. Yeah, and fall and just scatter and run. The, the, the teller was just like freaking out, but like trying to hold it together until she left. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just standing there working on stuff, and I'm like, what? That, she's Did getting that robbed just... or something? Because she's like, oh, weird, weird. Yeah, and I'm like, no, no. And then she's like, there's roaches everywhere. I remember someone bringing a roach filled PC back at Walmart one time. <laughs> there's like, it won't turn on. Open it up, roaches <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> and it's like, Somewhat, it looked like someone had literally severed the power cable going to the motherboard with a knife. Just like, no. Just no. You're not bringing this back in here. You need to get it out of here with the, all the roaches you brought in. And they just like pitched a fit. They were in the store for an hour, which means every fucking roach got out of that damn thing. Yeah. She had to be told by everybody up to the top manager of the store at the time, no. <laughs> you, put a gar- you put it in a garbage bag while you wait. So, so well, I, 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 I just heard... All right, later. But anyway, so you go back in and yeah. you fly in, and he's moved over to that empty uh, aisle there, and he's uh, got some boxes of uh, potato of chips, and he's stocked stock the shelf. Possess DC twenty two uh, will. Okay, you succeed. Okay, now since it's just mind control and I happen to be phased in the same space, I can compel him to do things by having that. Yeah. That's why I was just speaking before. <coughs> Like it was me talking through his mouth. But uh, just like compel him to paw around looking for bugs and Okay. You know, like like okay, what what we got here? Yeah, get, ooh, hey, but this thing kinda of moving on its own by my commands. Yeah. Um you start <laughs> you start filling himself up and <laughs> <laughs> Find a <the> camera. <laughs> <laughs> I feel me. Did you feel me? <laughs> oh, like I still get fired. Me it's like I still get fired of something. <laughs> <laughs> you go into the. Uh, no, no one yet. Um, you go. You go into the. You go into the uh, the beer cave, which is off the side of there. We'll say. Which is usually it's a cold room where they keep all the bits. Well, well he there. goes because I haven't I haven't uh, compelled him to remain in one place. So sure. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. So I'm groping myself. I do this in the beer <laughs> cave. <laughs> that is not process right. Uh-huh. Now. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I better do it in private. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so he goes in there, and uh, he starts feeling around and grabs the jerkins off the thing on the way and like you know uh, tell him to do that. I guess. You make a perception roll, I guess. Just be Occupy the same. It's gonna be. It's gonna be the same as when I'm feeling immaterially through someone. Yeah. So, uh, perception of twenty-one. Okay. Um, you spend enough time and make him do things that he's not comfortable with doing, and at his workplace, um, he doesn't know what came over him. But. Uh, yeah, you don't find any trace, any... You don't find any cockroaches or bugs on them. Hmm. I must have been wrong. Huh. Well, when when I leave him, his mouth will say, his ears will hear, Ah! Satan! Satan be gone! <laughs> 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 and then I will just disappear. Alright. Just like, after I'm outside, mother to myself, hopefully he's religious, and then he'll just play it himself out. <laughs> <laughs> so the movie scene he walks out of the beer cave like, <laughs> no one saw that he just walks back to the chips and start <laughs> mental note because I'm like watching through the closed circle security camera yeah we're never ever 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 taking him to a strip club ever <laughs> ever ever it's right squish him together girl anyway <laughs> wait a minute I can't touch them, but they can touch me. I possess her and touch me. <laughs> <laughs> the soon as you possess her, you can't feel anything. <laughs> she become an instant tranny. I did the same space. <laughs> Wait a second. There's something invisible but substantial here. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have to work on that power. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> so you fly back to the truck. And, you know, what do you what, tell him? What you want? I don't know what he was talking about, man. He didn't have anything on him. Uh, you know, I can. Uh, it was nice to get some practice. 
some shit get on camera that he probably ain't gonna be <laughs> proud of. But uh, uh, no, I think I think he's just gonna believe it was a demon in his brain or something because I, I gave him some uh, some cues as I left. I'm watching him through the closed security cameras. Has he walked back to the office to delete the tape yet? <laughs> <laughs> no? Okay. All right. Well, I, I will start watching through this. Clo- I'm sure I saw something, but apparently I'm, I might be mistaken. But I will start looking through any security cameras I can as we drive by. All right. M- they Can't must have just like you super just access the security stealth. camera and <sighs> oh yeah I don't know if I can rewind it though I don't know well, how it's, it's a it's not a tape DVR yeah it's, it's like offsite well then you off-site should be able to rewind it oh. really easily it's, if it doesn't have a no uh, I can't broadcast I forgot to buy broadcasting so I can talk I can listen to the whole thing and I can like tap into signal sources I cannot transmit. Yeah. Yeah, I, I just realized that was a major limitation to the power I have, but, you know, could be worse. I, You're still I, figuring things out. Yeah. Your next points can, uh, can totally free that up. Yep. So, anyway, but, yeah, so I start listening to all security cameras. Okay. And I also realize I cannot explain, I cannot translate this knowledge to you guys in any way other than my, me telling you verbally that I've seen it. Oh. Yeah, it seems a little bit uh, limited. It's okay, though. I bet you figure it out. I figured out while I was over there, I can compel people to do stuff when I'm in their heads. It's right. not just me puppeteering, but I can say, hey, do this. And it's like they did it. That's something. Okay, and you're, you're, we're never going to another strip club. What? Just saying. Come on, now. No, no. The temptations you would have there would be too great for any man. No, uh, that, that would be... That would be uh, I wouldn't do that. It doesn't. looks like somebody's cleaned up all the crime in this place. I've been doing some searching on the net and... Uh, how long has it been since a crime's been reported in um, the city? No, it's not completely cleaned up. There's still stuff that happens. Yeah, but... It's just a... It looks well kept, you know. Hmm. Well, th- this place looks like it's doing pretty well. I guess they don't need superheroes here. There's, there's still, you know, robberies and murders and stuff, but it's just not... They're clean. They're, they're just clean committed by the unassimilated. Okay, well... Who they get assim- assimilated. Yeah, what... Well, I start trying to, let's drive by the jail. We'll, we'll, I'll tap in there. If, if you were committing a robbery and you were being assimilated, I would assume you would get assimilated there. So we'll drive downtown-ish, find one of the local prisons, and we're going to eat lunch in a place close enough that I can uh, log we'll in the, the security prison. camera. Yeah. Next, well, n- not, like the, not like the full force penitentiary. I've got like the, the town jail where they're holding you overnight, you know. A two to three days stay jail, not the uh, prison. Federal pound you in the ass private prison? <laughs> yes. Well, the prisons have been privatized. You get an infraction. We've extended your stay for another three days. <laughs> what? Oh, you get another infraction for questioning us. That's Meanwhile, a while. You make iPhones. Yep. <laughs> Where do all the manufacturing jobs go? We- to legalize slavery. Yes. Anyway. Not they, racist. They found a way. Not not strictly. Well, but yeah, yeah some of it. You think build all our roads? Uh, well, our railroads. <laughs> no, no, no our, our highways too. A lot of them. Some, yes. Um, too much, let's just say. So anyway. you guys uh, decide you um, drive by uh, the closest, uh, move towards the closest police department. Um, that's where they would take people initially before they would go to a prison. Yeah, there's no the street. You, you think there's there's alien roaches assimilating people and cleaning the city at night because roaches want a clean city. No, a- alien, said maybe like alien. I don't know. <laughs> okay, the fact that the city's this clean is a little odd. It's not a hundred percent odd, but it's a little odd. So we're gonna spend a couple hours investigating and then we're gonna go to New York. But apparently this is the thing we're doing. Uh, this might be something that's good superhero work. It might not be. I don't know. Honestly, all of our all of our initial guesses so far have been wrong. So maybe we're wrong. Maybe I'm wrong here. But I want to at least investigate it briefly so we can see what is up. If you want to go to the prison, I can always practice my power, my new power. Yeah, you do that too. I'll get the you? warden to lead really stupid calisthenics. And it'll be like... Be like those plays that they put on in Korean jails. Those mm. things are awesome. No. They read in Thriller. 
Yes, but you don't have time to teach them all choreographed dance moves. Unless you can figure out how to split yourself into a thousand little... <laughs> oh god, I did not say that. I did not say that. I I'm that. sorry! <laughs> <laughs> and Moses the new villain. <laughs> <laughs> I could possess 30 people at once. Just a, it'll Only in, for choreographed in dance a moves. Deafening, in a deafening chorus. Hey, I took over a city! <laughs> <laughs> city! City! <laughs> we are revenant. We are revenant. Everything's fine. <laughs> Disintegrate. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you drive by the police station. Yeah. Everyone, remove your own livers. Now <laughs> 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 throw them with the heroes. <laughs> heroes. <laughs> <laughs> heroes die buried in livers. <laughs> heroes. That's adorable. All right, yeah, so we go to the nearest... Yeah, you drive by the police station, and uh, <laughs> it's kind of like, looks like a TV, uh, you know, the front of a police station out of a, like, you know, a TV show. Okay. It's in, like, a, you know, in a, in a larger building. There's police cars parked out front. Um, you actually see an officer walking at a, a guy in handcuffs. Okay, you go follow that guy in handcuffs invisibly. We're going to go to that corner place over there, and we're going to get lunch. Uh, Late lunch. Can you get me something too, right? Yeah, we'll get you something to go. We'll put it in the car. Cool. Or you yeah, can just have what mine is, because I'm probably not going to eat it. Well, he's going to chew it and put it back, so... I'll get you something here. separate. <laughs> Mister, I don't like I, my I, I said I just said vanish. I, didn't, I, didn't <laughs> I don't like my pre-chewed food. Seriously. There's a, there's a place uh, about a block away that you guys can pull in. And All right. We do so. All right. Can't park on the streets, Pittsburgh. No. <laughs> we can tell how quality of town is, is here too. Never been there. A lot of bulletproof glass. Yeah. <laughs> I remember the branch I was in was the most robbed in the Pittsburgh area. <laughs> Solid bulletproof <laughs> glass everywhere. Yep. And you're allowed to park on any of the streets because you got to have a parking permit. My my brother in law. Yeah, live there to get the permit. My brother in law li- lived uh, <laughs> lived there for a while going to college. Anyway. So it's, so like, you know like I said it shouldn't be the way it is. Yeah, right now. <laughs> it shouldn't, shouldn't be the way it's just being described right now. You know, there should be coal dust everywhere. That I do distinctly remember. If you get into any place that's been there for a long time and you Soot, dig, yeah. you find coal dust. <laughs> Soot. All right, so uh, All right. you're heading to your... What yeah, are you doing? What are you invisible and tangible. Just get a float in behind the, the prisoner and his guard or whatever. All right, well, he takes him in uh, to the you know, processing desk. And he starts, uh, he makes, you know, has the guy sit down, and he starts filling out paperwork. It looks like he's pulling him in for uh, possession charges, possible trafficking. Oh, that's different. Uh, not non-violent, but there was no resisting or anything like that, as you, you see he was writing. Um, so he finishes his report, uh, picks the guy up, starts walking towards the back. Float after. Alright. Uh, uh, trafficking. Drugs, I think. Yeah. <laughs> if it was human trafficking, that would be a whole different discussion. Oh, livers. Yeah, <laughs> livers. <laughs> now he's trying to eliminate him because of competition. Yeah, I'll follow him in there. <laughs> <laughs> I will see what he did and set him free because he's my contact. <laughs> <laughs> he's the ship that get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. Uh, that's been a good joke. <laughs> the guy walks to the back of the jail cell and he just kind of pulls him right on through it. <laughs> okay, it's like an open door policy. <laughs> so he takes him into a uh, one of the not like a cell, but like one of the just the rooms that where they sit him down and you know, not like a, the full interrogation room with the the double you know double uh, or the two way mirror. But anyway. He sits up down in one of those rooms. Okay, there's going to be interrogation. I'm going to eavesdrop. All right. So, um, seems to go... I mean, I, I'm not going to go through every single word play, but... I would not want you to. Yes. So, it, basically, he... Uh, the guy's... He's resistant to admitting that he's done these things as you would expect. Um... And he will not give up his... Since he won't give up his uh, his supplier, they're fully booking him on full charges. 
Invisible and tangible itch. Uh, Boy. You can say, you know, your inner dialogue if you want. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? Why am I in here? He's imagining fucking bugs. What the hell? <laughs> uh, make a perception check. I've had six grilled cheese sandwiches here. This perception is taking forever. Of uh, 18. Maybe something's gone wrong. Something's happened to him. I doubt that. Okay. Um, yeah. Things just went as... As you've seen. Okay, so you three guys. Can you stop over at that big Starbucks right there? <laughs> All right. We'll go to the Star- we go to the Starbucks to walk <laughs> over. The good Starbucks. The good so Starbucks. Not well, the bad one next door. Well, you're, you're, you pull in a small place. It's uh, The place you pulled in about a block away was uh, um, a small... It's a, it was a local place. They serve, like, your... Typical, you know, like American foods, like hot dogs, hamburgers, Burger stuff like that. that. But it's but it's a local non-chain place, so you guys decided to go pull in there. Okay. So you go to the window, and uh, who's, who's 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 you guys are ordering separately or together? If you, I don't know, the reason I want to know, so if it, I don't know, you, you don't have three checks or one one check. I'm going in. We're all going in. Um, we'll just each order separately and carry it to a table. Yeah, that's. Fairly typical. Yeah. All right. So, someone make a decision on who orders first, second, and third, and then roll checks in that order. Perception check. I'll order first. All right. All right. Order. And if you're, all, if you're over for like a twenty-eight, I don't think we're ever gonna get it. Perception <laughs> of uh, twenty-three. Okay. Damn um, good check. You're standing. So you're standing there, and you're. Uh, as you're handing, you reach down your your money and you're counting out. As you look up for a second, you can kind of see it in the back room, and up on one of the uh, the hanging, uh, uh, how can I say the word, the spatulas. Mm-hmm. I think you see something kind of like if this is the like flat of it. You, you think you see something you like go around the back of it, but it's instantly gone. Mm. Yeah. The attack um, of the no see Do that while I'm... Attack of the fasties. Ordering and paying, I'll, I'll uh, mention that uh, yeah, this town looks really clean. It looks great. Is that that's something new? Because I heard this town was like an old, like, you know... I heard it was dirty. The, yeah. <laughs> old dirty, filthy, rotten town. Set on fire. Yeah, that's that's I'm surprised down. when I pulled in. Well, uh, this place looks great. It's r- relatively young girl at the counter. She's probably going to be like 18, 20, 19, something like that. She's like, oh well. Um, a couple years ago, the the new mayor started a new clean clean up the town initiative, and it seems to be working pretty well. Oh, yeah, I'd say it is. It's amazing. The place really got turned around. Yeah, it's it's nice too because not everybody knows about it, and it's uh so we have this nice clean city, and it's not overcrowded, and it's pretty great living here right now. That's amazing. Maybe I have to move this way. Oh well. Well, so I hope you come back here. Next, she looks at your ass as you walk away. <laughs> Everyone looks at his ass. I look at his, I look ass, his ass when he walks away. away. <laughs> Me especially, it's my thing. <laughs> Somehow that happens. You know. <laughs> Who's next? I'll go next. All right. I go up and order my number two. All right. Uh, <coughs> Twenty-two. Okay. Um, so you're uh, kind of doing the same thing, and uh, you go to pay for it, and you hand her your money. She, you know, beep, 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 beep and uh, she gets out your change, and she's closing the drawer. You fit as the drawer's closing. Uh-huh. You think you maybe saw something crawl up in the drawer as it closed, but again, there's no way to, it happened so quick that there's no way to be exactly sure what it was. Mm-hmm. How big is this thing? Like half the size of this flashlight. Okay. Yeah. Fourteen. I don't know this shit. <laughs> All I can I think of is Mr. Mind from DC. Maybe I was wrong. Okay. So you, yeah, you don't uh, grilled you, cheese. Everything looks good. You don't. Let's see. I'd like your plainest, most basic, crappiest sandwich, probably grilled cheese or something like that. And also a really nice pastrami on rye with a, a Reuben. You know, something good. So I, I go back oh. to the table with my Reuben. Oh, this is delicious. 
Uh, it's so good. It's so delicious. I never taste it. So this, is, <laughs> this is what happens while you're doing your following and yeah. stuff. <laughs> all right. So, <coughs> oh, I get back to the. Or they all get to the yeah, table. Sorry, you're all sat down now. Yeah. All right. Um, yeah, I, I definitely saw something back in the kitchen that was like crawling on a spatula. Okay. I thought so. I saw something on the register. I didn't see shit. So, well. They're, well, they're really small and hard to see, so we need to figure out what these bugs are. Maybe there's like a centralized, <gasps> maybe there's a central big bug villain, and we can actually have some sort of a real actual superhero fight with a giant bug monster, like we did in Cairo two years ago. That was a really big scarab. It was, but we it was so cool. We actually saved people and were good heroes and stuff. <laughs> <coughs> more importantly, safe the one of the pyramids. Uh. <laughs> yeah, we saved a pyramid. We saved people. It was. It was. Or we could just give them the. It was almost the crushed by that Titanic like, dump ball. Hey, you got a book problem. <laughs> you know, if we're just gonna, <laughs> if we're just gonna do this amount of effort, I could fly to my island and just live there. It will be happy. I will hear the radio right. chatter constantly. Well, yeah. So we, we'll look into it. Right I, now, just I envision like Arc Force laying on a beach with like nipple clamps leading to a bunch of solar panels. <laughs> 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 ah. Oh wait, got 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 my polarity inverted. Okay. <laughs> Strangely enough, I'm not against that mental image of myself. I'm actually at this point. Now that I've watched Logan, I've decided I'm going to get a boat. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't seen it. You should get a boat. <laughs> Playing a superhero game, I didn't see the new superhero movie. It was a whole different kind of movie. I can't take my kid. That's Not true. At all. That is very true. And well, uh, that is an amazingly <coughs> clean restroom. That is just, okay. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I've never I mean, seen a restroom that clean in one of these local spaces. There wasn't even a skid mark on the toilet. Not even a skid mark on the toilet. That just doesn't make any sense. And I was pretty sure I left one. Twi- when I got up and looked around, <laughs> it wasn't there. <laughs> 26 investigates while I'm in the jail. Okay. What are you looking for? <laughs> Shit, man, I don't know. Signs of the bugs, I guess, since apparently there's bugs. Okay. Because I've been told that there's bugs. I know they are looking for bugs. And I haven't seen anything. All right. right. So you're uh, you're going to all the places where... Like looking, for, so you're looking for bugs. You're going to all the places where, you're like, okay, a bug would hide here. You're looking under desks. You're looking under file cabinets and behind them, and you're not finding any bugs at all. Where anywhere where bugs would be. Well, th- there is an occasional spider up in a corner or something, but it's usually in a dark. It's been, it's in like somewhere where it can't be reached by like like a cleaning personnel or something. Hmm. So, and by occasion, I mean like all, with a twenty-six, you found like three, three bugs, three spiders, like in the whole building. A yeah. spider. Yeah. yeah, but spiders aren't the same as insects and bugs. I think what you're not taking from this is that's freaking amazing. Yeah, no, it's it's it's, <laughs> it's, it's impossible uh, under normal circumstances. On okay. a low roll, I think I can find more than that here. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> logic says that the person in charge, if anybody's bugged, he's bugged. So, start looking, let's see here, it's a local jail, so what, the sheriff? This is just a police, this is a Pittsburgh Police Department. Lieutenant or captain or something. Okay, so I look for the police captain. Okay, um, Cap, you're at zone, which one did I have you go to? You're in Department Zone Two building. You, you know, you notice that you find documentation and stuff saying this is in the Zone Two building. Um, As a former private dick, I guess I would know a little bit more. Yeah, there's mul- the multiple, you know, you know, police buildings hey, dick. in different zones in the uh, in the area. So um, this one is just headed up by a lieutenant. So it's just like a precinct office then. Right. Okay. So I, I just look for that lieutenant. Okay. Just you know, looking looking at badges, looking for names. 
Oh, All right, yeah, that's uh, it's Lieutenant Sandberg. So he, you're looking for him, and uh, what's the name of that show? Andy Sandberg's. Did not say Sandberg? It said Sandberg. Sandberg. Oh, okay. I thought that was the guy's last name. No. Anyway. Okay. So find the guy. Yeah. Okay. He's at his desk. Is there anybody else with him? Nope. He seems to be doing paperwork. Is his office door closed or open? Uh, it's just slightly. It's like just slightly ajar. Okay. I possess it. <laughs> DC twenty two will. I doubt he has a twelve or a ten. What does this guy have? This is probably quite close to the equivalent. Uh, no, he fails. Okay. Compel him to stand, walk to the door, and close it. Okay, that's a simple enough request. He just gets up and does it. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> he wouldn't necessarily know why he's doing it, but um, compel him to speak aloud anything he knows about bugs. It's <laughs> 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 like that's it is head. What do I know about bugs? <laughs> Most books have six legs. Well, <laughs> um, oh, I really don't like mosquitoes. Flies are annoying. I heard they eat bugs over in over in Southeast Asia. Don't know why you'd want to do that. So I'm thinking not, not, not a whole lot of uh, bugs in here. Where are all the bugs? You think maybe this is what are all the bugs with uh, the mayor's cleanup initiative? Um, Im- so just implant implant the notion that people are controlled by bugs. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> 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 okay. Um, what do you know about the clean city? Plant the notion that people are controlled by bugs. <laughs> <laughs> Great noise. He's now going to okay. paranoid. Oh, well, you've ruined this man's life. <laughs> Good work, man. He goes back to his desk and sits down and picks up his phone and says, Send in Detective Lindbergh. <laughs> Com- compel him to go on about his business. <laughs> yes. Oh, God. Huh. You know, just 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 sit. He's just gonna sit in his body though, and, <laughs> and, <laughs> and ask him the next morning he's gonna be found in a dumpster. <laughs> <laughs> so I sure hope Revenant isn't screwing <laughs> up anybody's <laughs> life with this new <laughs> possession power. <laughs> <coughs> so uh, he wouldn't do that. Shh. Well, five minutes later, this guy comes in. He's in uh, a suit, and he's he's obviously got a gun under his shoulder, and he's got a badge hanging from his hip. He sits down. Uh, you can you see me, Lieutenant? He's like, yeah, yeah, sit down. Close the door. <laughs> God, <why not? laughs> All right, so he shuts the door. He's like, look, I've been uh, getting this feeling that I think, uh, and then, like, you know, this, <laughs> this, this well, you're, you're seeing it close, but the seed would switch to the outside of the hallway. He goes, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm serious. <laughs> you want me to look into that? <laughs> and he's like, I think people are being controlled by bugs. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Um, all right, Lieutenant, we'll, we'll, we'll get on that immediately. Is that all you needed? Uh, yeah, I think so. Well, get, uh, get, get me a report as soon as you can. Yeah, you got it. And he stands up, <laughs> the, the detective stands up and walks out. And he, the lieutenant goes about his business. <laughs> Internal dialogue. Shit, what do I do now? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we got nothing. Worst so hero. Back to you guys, what are you doing? So I was thinking that uh, if maybe this whole cleanup initiative came from, you know, the mayor, maybe the mayor has something to do with these things we keep seeing. Okay, let's go look at the mayor. Uh, Sounds like a good idea. Oh, man, I cannot eat any more of this sandwich. I can. Oh. <laughs> Alright. 
Did you get something for Revenant? Yeah. There's a little box uh, you know, to go. It says kids meal on it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he'll appreciate that. I got him a grilled cheese sandwich. He loves grilled cheese. It's all I ever get him. All right, Revenant, this is a bust. We're, we're, we're getting ready to bolt book. We're in the Starbucks, or, or we're next. We're in the local shop next to the Starbucks. Not the Starbucks in front of you. You got to go left a little bit, and there's another Starbucks. Take a right there and go to the third Starbucks. We're in the store next to that. Compel, compel the uh, lieutenant to write down his smartphone number. He's the only one with a smartphone that was not a government one. Okay. Just, and just implant the notion that if he finds himself in trouble because of bugs, <laughs> he should call that number. All right. And that, then that can be a thing. And then leave. Notes, All right. Notes, notes. We're getting back out to the car. <coughs> Dang. Mm. Little, little cup of coffee. Some french fries with the meal. Come up through the floorboards. Yeah, that was a uh, wasted time. All I right. Think. Oh, all right, we're going to go check with the mayor next, then we're calling this latest fiasco as us just being crappy superheroes and moving on. On the outside cha- chance that it actually uh, wasn't something, I gave the police lieutenant your phone number. It's secure, right? So it's not a bad thing, right? We need to get some burner cell phones. Oh, mine's linked to an alternative identity, so... Oh, we're good, though. Yeah, all right. We still could get some burner cell phones. We should we should look into that. <coughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, burner cell... Shit. Uh, those cheap prepaids are smartphone, smartphones now, too. Uh, yeah. I can uh, get some Angry Birds again. I miss my, uh, my government phone Angry Birds. Got a point. I miss my government phone. Sorry, so sad it hit the water and totally turns out <laughs> waterproof my ass. <laughs> well, it really depends on the velocity with which you hit the water. Okay, waterproof at 60 miles an hour in my ass. Yeah, nobody ever made that claim. Well, I, I mean, made that claim. Well, that's because you're a mentally ill, uh, weird, glowy guy that what ain't got no mass to it. Well, why don't you go pick us up some phones? Okay, by pick up you mean purchase, right? Well, I think you need to purchase them to activate them. So yeah, it's yes. not going to work unless I... Okay, give me, give me the water bills. Well, yeah, but I think you're better off picking up the phones without there being knowledge as you're picking them up. Just leave the money. I think you need to activate... Do we need to activate them? I don't know. Would would my character know that it has to be passed through the f- actual financial transaction of the register? Because I know for a fact that it has to. Not all can do. Mm, yeah. It has, to, it has to be activated that way. You'd have to uh, scrub the MEID. Like, do you have hacking skills? Yes. Okay, so I'll go <laughs> drop the amount of money I would need in order I'm to... I'm just asking you for pick, to pick up some burner phones. And then just and <laughs> basically steal them and leave the money in the register. Okay. That's right, in the register. Yeah. But it's going to be mysteriously over. Yeah, just, just go ring them up. <laughs> Put the money in the register. That works too. Oh my god! Look, look, whatever you gotta do, just yeah. it's not hard to do. Look, there's, I, I look, pos- there's, there's a phone store. Hold on, I po- <laughs> I possess some guy. Oh god! I I he, the guy has the money in his pocket because I can phase it into his pocket. He goes up and it's a legal transaction, cash transaction. There, no problem. He just throws away. The phones. I immediately leave him and phase them down through the ground to come bring him back. Okay, that's okay. perfectly fair. Now the guy's thinking, "Why the fuck did I just throw away two hundred dollars in phones? Why did I buy those phones? Where did that money come Where from? Where did two hundred dollars? <laughs> How did I get to the store? I was on the other side of town. <laughs> Good thing I have change left to get me a steel reserve. You leave him, leave him a twenty dollar bill. They didn't Not have wrong. before. And I got a tip. Anyway. I had like four Iron City beers at the restaurant. Those things taste awful, I guess. Oh, they <laughs> might taste amazing. I really can't tell. They smelled awful. Well, Revenant, question. <coughs> What's that taste like? 
A little bit of fire shooting out. Electrified beard. My my uh, uh, eyes roll back in my head, and I involuntarily face through the f- you know floorboards again and disappear. <laughs> and I roll down all the windows in the truck. All right, I guess they do taste pretty bad. Yeah, what does that tell you, you dumb son of a bitch? Pay back enjoy up. your sandwich. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'm, I don't know how much I'm going to enjoy it now. Man, that's a pit little... <laughs> really? Anyway. Here's uh here's the phones. There's not even any Capricola on there. <laughs> they're uh, fully they're fully well purchased by some uh, some Filipino guy. I don't know what he was. All right, well we each have a burner cell phone now, or we give I don't know how many burner cell phone two hundred dollars by how many burner cell phones. Nowadays, uh, it'll buy you know two really good ones, uh, four okay ones, or four okay burn. We got four okay ones there. Okay, yeah. yeah. Four ones that we pull them out in public don't look ridiculous. So. <laughs> well, <laughs> the twenty dollar ones just all say sm- track phone on them and uh, have three and a half inch screens. Yeah. So th- these they're all four to five inch screens. Uh, probably one of the uh, oh what was that one L- LG line uh, op- Optimus. They're all there's a four LG Optimus T's or whatever the T Mobile. I had a prototype was. iPhone eight. And now I've got an Optimus. I'm pretty sure this thing doesn't even have a VR mode. No, it doesn't have a VR mode. No way to really buy that without there being a charge for it, huh? I mean, you could get one of those headset things and shove it in there. It's the right size. See those. But the resolution's 800 by 480. So that probably wouldn't be too good that close. All right, fine. I take my newly acquired cell phone and start charging it by shoving my thumb into the socket. <laughs> Actually, I've got all of them. I'm just like sticking fingertips into the end of it. All right, I got this. It'll be fully charged. Give me that. It's got 70%. It's fine. Okay. Yeah. If I, I had I, custom, I could just take burner phone with that and make it a custom. Thug-jick. Thug-jick. Yeah. Thug-jick. Thug-jick. Got yeah, it. Just shoving them in my leg. About a quarter inch. I didn't want it to throw my points off. <laughs> That's fine. Gotta find the wire. Okay, there you go. They're all getting charged now. Maximum charge power. These days, I'm gonna figure out how to directly charge the battery remotely. Then I'll be a hit at parties. What, like uh, power mat? Yeah, something like that. Okay. Just directly energizing the lithium it's ion cells. But in any case, the car's right. on fire. So we're going to find the mayor now and do the exact same thing we just did. <laughs> <laughs> Boy. For this being the Ooh. mayor's last day in office, it's really an impressive thing. Yeah, he did a great job with this town. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> you know, see, this is what makes people... We're trying to be good superheroes, and that's important. We're not doing anything crazy or stupid. We're not killing people. We're not implanting weird suggestions into people's minds that'll ruin their careers. We're just being good soup pe- mm-hmm. American citizens investigating a possible situation. Mm. I knocked down oh. the pigs. I thought you were playing Candy Crush. Okay. Talk to the mayor. Maybe nah, we can screw that uh, shit. You know, catch one of these bugs. Figure out what it is. I still ain't seen no bugs. There, there were four four spiders. I swept through the whole jail. There were four spiders. I don't even know if they're eating. You're you're. You know, for being the scout, you are terrible at seeing things. <laughs> Just gonna throw that out there. Yeah, it says you, man. If Patriot saw it, and if Patriot saw it, that's good enough for me. This guy, so this bit. Yeah. the sprayer, the sprayer of walls, the, the <laughs> human, the, the human DNA trail. This is who we trust now. I've always trusted Patriot. Yeah, you've always. He is our commanding officer. Always been stupid like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's an officer now. Yeah, sure is. He was always an officer. No, no, he was before. I'm he's not going to contest Patriot. that. Captain Patriot. The only kind of bitch here. Well, we're going to go Captain America, but apparently that's trademarked. <laughs> yeah, that's some bullshit. Woo-hoo, demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, grilled cheese. Purple grilled cheese. One I, got, I got your french fries, too. I ate about half of them, but I got your french fries. You don't even need food. Well, would you like some? <laughs> No. 
So, no, 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 not so much. Uh, do you have to eat normally, or can you just phase the food into your stomach? Haven't tried. Not gonna. I mean, that would prevent you having to brush your teeth as much. Me, I have to brush I'm my teeth almost six times. So you have to keep changing between forms <laughs> to brush your teeth in each variable form. That's if we're not fighting anybody. You found a finger in there once. <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird day. Try spitting, try flushing that down the toilet at the restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> well, all I can say is it's a good thing that you don't eat the guys that we kill, you know, anymore. Well, not that it's been caused, not a lot of terrorists to stop recently. Remember though when he uh, tried to pass that foot? <laughs> <laughs> would have been fun if he was a raptor at the time or a T-Rex or whatever, but he was a dude. Oh. Well, Reggie did have to fix it. And he you did. Came, and you don't have to sit the donut anymore, so life is pretty <laughs> good. <laughs> yeah, human anus ain't uh, designed for that. <laughs> we know it's not one foot wide, though. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. <laughs> so... All right, we got the city council building. We can all go in here. We'll just park at the attached parking garage and walk on in. Yes, there is a parking garage. Gay rage. All right. I'll be sure to take my taser and stuff it in the door of the truck. Zappa do. That's pretty fair. You know, something about walking into a government building with a taser strapped to your side. Or a large weapon. Or yeah, or vests. Or yeah. Lightning gun. <laughs> Lightning gun. <laughs> just stating different art cannons. So you guys go into the parking garage here in the in the garage. What are you doing? No, we're just parking. Yeah, we'll park. We're gonna <laughs> go up to the main entrance. We're gonna walk right in. You can scout ahead. We're looking for the mayor to see if anything interesting is going on. But at this point, uh, my confidence is not high. We're gonna find anything. But we're also looking for those bugs. We're gonna ostensibly. Um, we have a city tax problem, so we want to go to the tax office to talk about some forms that we need to get. That's our cover story. So right. there's a tax office on one floor in there. We don't know which floor. We're fine with that. And we're going to go find it and fill out some forms. All right. Espionage mode activate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're opening up a cupcake store, if anyone asks. Oh, my God. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we need some reason to be here. That's as good as any. So I'm floating around in there. Okay, so you guys take the uh, elevator up to the street level, and we'll just say it uh, kicks you out on the, the right side of the building there. Uh, we're walking around front. Yep, you take the stairs up in there and head in the doors. We oh no! I, I really so, should buy new clothes. <laughs> hey, I bought new clothes. We were over at the gift shop at the casino. I bought some. I'm wearing like jeans and a t-shirt that says whatever the casino's name on it is. Right, right, so you're just walking around like yeah, uh, salam alaikum, salam alaikum. <laughs> Straight new turban. <laughs> racist. <sighs> no, if I was trying to be racist, I would have actually attempted an accent instead of just pretending to be some. I'm trying so to open a 7-Eleven. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> right. Wow. So, as you guys go oh, inside, sorry, drive through. All right. listen to the man. As listen. you guys go inside the door, uh, you're walking up to the information desk. Yep. Because that's you don't know where you don't know where the tax office is, so yeah. you're heading to the information desk. Yeah. You go up there, and uh, there's a. Younger guy working there, though. He's in a nice suit. Yeah, I kind of, when we walked in, I kind of I I checked to make sure that the office we're actually looking for is somewhere in the building. Um, I, I pick an office. Yeah, yeah. You walk you walk in and you turn around and there's a list on the wall of yeah, all the so different departments. So I walk up to the front thing and said, you know, ask him about it and just so we can spend some time looking at him to see if I see any bugs there. Okay. Uh, I want Patriot to make me an insight check. Insights. Oh, it's almost a 20. <laughs> um, um, 17. Uh, 17. Mm -hmm. 
for this time of day, you get the sense that there's not as many people in the lobby as there should be. Hmm. You, you're going up and talking to the guy. And you're yeah. I just general small talk. Blah blah blah. I already know it's kind of on the seventh floor. I'm just asking him to give me the nice. Go to the elevator around the corner and push the seven button, and you'll get over there. Like, okay, oh, I you. need you to make me an insight check as well. I know what my insight is. That's getting cut out. Plus two. <laughs> Six. Okay. Um, I need you to. So you're sit, what are you? What are you doing while he's? Ramble, ramble, ramble. Yeah. Ramble, ramble. While he's rambling, I'm going to uh, kind of look around at the different security features and such in the building. Kind Turn of into a dinosaur and eat everybody. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you uh, start kind of just milling about the yeah the lobby. Um, the lobby actually extends all three of those archways. Okay. It's, only, it's about roughly 20 feet deep, and there's a lot of... Uh, like city memorabilia and uh, things uh, and st- like statues and busts and stuff of former like mayors and important people and uh, there's plaques then to show the different places in the city and any current events boards or anything? Um, not really so much. There is there is a <coughs> excuse me there is a flat screen in one of the far back left corner that kind of just has a news channel on, but. Okay. Um. Oh, if I notice that, do I notice that they're playing any more of us being terrorists? Um, they're not, but you're also kind of busy looking at this guy. Okay. Yeah, you're so kind of, your attention's focused there. All right. Some dude. Um, so go ahead and make me a reception roll. Since you're looking for that specific. 29. Thing. Woo! Um, you're... Pretty sure you see uh, something crawl, like from like the desk from and go under his desk. God damn! Well, the twenty ninety should be able to count the legs. <laughs> no, I really can't. I can get one point higher than that if I roll a twenty. So, all right. I, I, I it, it, it's a combination of speed and size. Okay. Well, I mean, I, I believe you. I can't see it, but I'm just like, damn. His 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 superhero senses are based in electronics, not on. Hey, there's that thing. <laughs> yeah. If they were electronic bugs, I would have them. Right. So about this about this time, um, you're kind of checking out the security features. You notice that the uh, see how the the glass in the uh, archways there is kind of like patterned. Yeah. Um, you notice that there are actual there are gates that match the mullions in the glass. On the inside that goes straight down, mm-hmm. but not out of place. It's a government building. If you know, right? With the entire stuff along, but as you're noticing that, you hear a click, and they start going. Are they just get trapped. Um, well, I mean, they're they're moving down at a very at a very fast speed, not a dangerous like. You know, so the, obviously there's no one in the doorways at this point. Right. Is that there would be obviously sensors for that. They're not going to go, oh, smash, fucking kill children. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh it's a tour of the mayor's office. All the kids are dead. <laughs> <laughs> kill by gate. But anyway, so they're slamming clothes like... If you want... Since you were specifically looking for that stuff... If you want uh, to try and get out before they close, I'll give you a, a shot at it. <laughs> See ya. I'm not here, I'm a coward. <laughs> or you can hang out and say. Um, could it go a little bit different way about it? All right. Uh, so this looks like more like, in my mindset, this is more like, okay, we're, we're, we're trying to be trapped. Is the way my mindset's kicking it. Okay. So I will, uh, towards the center one, where uh-huh. that big wide door is, Sure. as it's coming down, mm-hmm. I'm going to shift in a tri- ter- triceratops. Okay. It's a huge creature. Ooh, okay. jumping, jumping right to, uh, okay. And I'm going to horn the thing open. All right. So you have some kind of, you know, 
crazy super strength stuff with that, right? Uh, pretty much. Let's see, it's uh, huge. So that'll just be a straight up uh, strength roll. Do you have a strength power called Gore? Gore, Gore, <laughs> Gore. <laughs> what does Al Gore have to do with me? It's the internet. No. Oh. <laughs> Global internet warming. <laughs> Someone bugs. screams when they see the Triceratops. Uh, uh, Patriot, you screams. notice as soon as these gates start to fall, like the people that were in the lobby are running. They look like they had notice and are running towards like the doors adjacent, like that are on the interior walls. Like trying to get out, trying to get out of that room. Okay. Like they might have had five seconds notice, but it was enough for them to go. <laughs> Twenty six. Okay. So you run up, and as it's coming down, the other two land and yeah. hit. You get your three horns inside there, and catch it in about about four feet from the from. If it's if it hits the ground. All right. Um, when they start running for those doors, I'm gonna run with them. Okay. Ah! <laughs> well, I figure if the doors are probably gonna shut. I wanna, you know, not be in Try there. one. Well, get in there and <laughs> keep it open. Also. All right. All right. I'm standing there. I whip around. Don't worry, Patriot. What are we doing? You see him running towards the door. <laughs> oh! Make, it, make an athletics check. Patriots. Oh, I'm super <laughs> <fun. laughs> His gut bulges out again. That's how athletic he is. <laughs> athletics. He throws his gut in the doorway. <laughs> <laughs> 17. And then to, then to melt the door, he goes... <laughs> <laughs> Looks like an acid for me. Well, if I'm double moving, it's a thousand feet around. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, the little school kids who are in the mayor's <laughs> office for a tour, boom, bowling right. pins. So the door you're running towards, <laughs> as soon as you sort of kind of like make a move towards that door and make, you see it start a, a gate coming across there. And there's, ah. a, and there's the other ones are closing at like normal speed, normally fast speed. Mm -hmm. This one kind of like power closes. Yeah. And actually catches a woman's ankle as she's jumping through the door. Oh, God. All right. All right. Well, with our, is the door still open at all or is it? Not this much. <laughs> <laughs> well, enough for her. Uh, uh, grab her and phase her free. Oh. Well, you're kind of coming up from the garage and. So are we doing uh, mm -hmm. combat stuff? Yeah. I thought I was. Yeah, I thought I was uh, acting as scout. That's what I was told so to do. You were heading to the mayor's office. I thought. Yeah, we're in the uh, main lobby. Okay. You're you're doing. I don't know that I had a chance to do anything. Yeah. It, well, that's it's fine. You can still be in the lobby, I guess. But yeah, if you want to be in the lobby, that's fine. But yeah. for this particular the patriot, be if, closest if, to the person. If, if you want, if you want to make that your first action and the thing, that's perfectly fine. Sure. All right, so let me do something real quick here. Breathing like Kevin today. Raise your hand, sir. Yeah, 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 Oh, right. um, Revenant is 12. Arc Force was what? Somewhere. Nine, but Arc Force is finding a new dice. Uh, that guy's not old. Patriot was what? 
Seven. Seven. Yeah. Utah Eleven. was what? Eleven. Eleven. Okay, well that changed the order of stuff. You should really speed up. I rolled a two. I know, but still. Yeah, by like it improved happens. initiative four or five times. You can you could literally at this level get like a plus twenty or something. Before Shut up, <coughs> Dan. Dexterity is in play. What can I say? Oh, hey, look at that. I need to figure all these guys out. Look, there's a big pile of my cat stuck like cordwood that I took a picture of. I'm like, eee. Shut up. i rapid Dan. I would love to play rapid Dan again. I wouldn't like that. <laughs> oh, wow. I who I would play next if we were doing new characters. He'd be the greatest hero of all time. He would have the greatest powers and the greatest strengths. It'd be tremendous. No, 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 no. <laughs> they don't like it when we get political. <laughs> yes, they do. <laughs> All right, so. Out of the, off the back wall, uh, one door opens up on, on the side, um, kind of behind the information desk. And. Two people come out. It's the mayor and deputy mayor. Picture. And they're ready to have that fight on the side of the building. <laughs> That's not the right building to have that on. I don't know. I mean, how tall is it? You can only see the you know first, what, five? I already have a picture four? of the building where Ryan's going to have a skyscraper fight. <laughs> <laughs> we just got to get to New York. So the two of these guys come out. So the first one Move this over here so I can see fucking stuff. Uh, raises up his weapon, which doesn't quite look like that, but I couldn't find the exact picture. Um, I couldn't find a guy with the picture of the gun I wanted in it. So, guy with the gun. Yeah. Wag. I thought I saved that. Where the crap is it? <coughs> I blame those. Gosh darn it. <coughs> what are we sitting around waiting for? <laughs> waiting for me to get a picture. Because stuff to happen. It's uh, mildly it's important. Oh, that's what I call it. Okay. Get away. They have those in their hands when it pops up. Oh, that looks okay. very similar to the weapon that exploded in the guy's hand that killed him. But it looks like a more complete model, like a more finished, polished version of it. Okay. The other one looked very like experimental from your memory. Well. Uh -huh. And the first guy immediately open immediately opens fire on the triceratops because oh my god, there's a <laughs> fucking triceratops in the, in the lobby. That's new. <laughs> well, at least in triceratops form. Okay. So that's a crit. Holy hell. <clears throat> That's kind of what it's going to take. So it's an armor penetrating round. It's a penetration on it. Um, four, I think. That's enough to beach anything we've got. Yeah, I've got that's the idea. Yeah, I've got impervious. Eight, probably, but one level of penetrating beats two letters in impervious. Dude. By what? 
Ten, ten ranks were burned. Yeah. Anyway, so it's a uh, yeah penetrating four, and because it's a crit, it's a DC twenty four toughness save. Well, that's doable because in Triceratops form, my toughness is eighteen. Mm, nice plus eighteen. Oh, nice. As that is the max. Oh, oh, it's a tractor. You get a dodge check against it. My dodge is negative two because I'm really big. Okay. That's the trade-off. Roll it at 20 though. May as well. Sure, I will attempt to dodge. No. <laughs> now I will attempt to shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off. Oh, oh. Uh, for a 29. Okay. What's the trade-off for toughness? Is it is it uh, two hit? It's your dodge, your active defenses. Oh, okay. So that's why it's negative two. Right. I'm a triceratops. Yeah. You literally can hit the side of a barn. I'm basically a tank. Now, granted, all I can really do is horn something and hold it, and then take hits. And Triceratops. Well, you, you took the hit, but it didn't apparently do anything to you. Yeah, need a uh, yeah, new prototype gun. <coughs> <coughs> this prototype sucks. Yes. Yeah, right. but it would have slaughtered the raptor or the uh, yeah, pretty much anything else. All right, so the other guy comes out and does you know exactly the same thing because they basically came out at roughly the same time. Um, not not a crit this time, so this is only DC nineteen. Yes. Okay. Uh, that, that's actually higher. Q. Right. Uh, Revenant. Um, possess one of those guys? All right. So we have a uh, thing of that. That 20 goes like a dick. Headache! <laughs> 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 Boing! Actually, you get in there and you almost feel a force fighting back against you. That's what's going to do that. Okay. Um, fly back down through the floor, holding my my intangible head like, how? What was that? <laughs> okay, this is still new, so I'll try again in a second. All right. Uh, you try, doctor, you doctor Trops. <laughs> doctor Trops. Um, is the. Well, first make another strength check. Let's say the gate's still forcing him. Yes. I bet it's forcing you to work, so. Uh, 24? Okay, you're able to maintain your hold. Until told otherwise, I'm holding the exit open. Okay. Fair enough. You're maintaining that. Or I'm force. Taking shots in the ass. Uh, <laughs> and wiggling my ass because of stings. <laughs> I, Ow! Out of that hearth. Shoot Ow. one of them with electric bolt and it'll bounce off of him and hit the other guy at the same time. Chain lightning? Yeah. Chain lightning. Go chain lightning. Oh, it was on a 20. 14 plus 8, 22 to hit. It was in your so lap you where it was. Yes. No, oh, that definitely does not dodge. So DC on that one is a good old fashioned um, twenty-three. Uh, so 23. does it jump to the next guy? Yeah. Does he get a dodge? Yes. Okay. Same number. Yes, it's same number. Wow. Okay, so you go. <laughs> they go. <laughs> and they both fall down. Oh, okay. Oh. I use my. I, <laughs> I use my electro grabbing power to. Grab their guns. Is that another action? I'll wait till next round, yeah. Okay. Patriot. You just saw him chain lightning the guy and they both both dropped their guns. Good. Well there's a lady here with her foot stuck in a thing too, right? Or do you, you didn't take Patriot, that. make it a tell an electrol. Electrol. Shit! <laughs> <laughs> that wow! <laughs> I mean, it's suddenly a super de- it? super duper genius. That twenty. So oh. like, those guns explode when they leave those people's hands. As the guy turned into goop, approved. No, no, no. <coughs> turn into goop. They'd be Please. super holding them super duper tight because they'd be Please. clutching them because they got electrocuted. Well, when they fall down. Better than the old ones? Alright. 
fine. Maybe they explode more. <laughs> All right, I'll. Uh, I do not want to be inside this when this happens. <laughs> well, this is, should be a pretty freaking big area if it's a central a lobby of. Yeah, it's like twenty by twenty foot by like a hundred by like. 30, 40 feet ceiling. No. But it's there's a good chance these could that two of these could bring down half the building. So where is Revenant? Oh, I just went through the floor holding my head. He's, he, he's, he's not here. Damn. It's just not my turn yet. I mean, you're the commander. You could say something. Yeah. Well, I was going to throw the guns over to you. Well, I'll still do that. All right, so... Oh, you got a woman with her leg stuck in the door. Or explodey guns. Yes. Like, well, like, okay, explode so guns. She's like, ah! Ah! <laughs> Stay calm, man. It's and crushing run. my leg. <laughs> All right. <coughs> so I'll run over, scoop up the guns, and, and stick them to crack in the door. <laughs> toss them over where Reverend just was, where he fell through the floor. They're already there. Hmm? Are you? Yeah. He tried to possess the guys. Yeah, they went down through, through the floor. Pay yeah. attention, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know he went to the floor. I just forgot why. He run over, you pick the guns up, and you go. Well, <laughs> 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 I must have possessed him to do that. <laughs> <laughs> He's still practicing. <laughs> Please, if I if I took control of the Patriot, I would have been like, I'm leaving a lie! I should have gone into dance. <laughs> anyway. Hmm. You said never to talk about that. <laughs> that, was, that was after Cairo. That was after Cairo. <laughs> so, uh, if I look at the gun, do they look like they're doing anything? Flashing? The uh, there's a red light blinking on both of them. Oh, yeah, that happened before, I think. <laughs> yep. It feels like more than one turn, though. Just run over, pick up the guns, look at it. Yeah, that's nice. Um. Like, where the hell are you, Revenant? Get rid of these guns! Death core okay. building. So, <laughs> on the yeah. yeah, okay. So, anything else? Uh, mm-hmm. Who else is around? Is it just the, the two guys with the guns? Everyone else. That is, I'm over shooting lightning at them. I'm in front of the information desk. He's by the gate. He's underneath directly where you're standing. Yeah. You're holding I two bombs. He's so, like, the lightning there. like just stopped, and you looked over, remembered that, oh, fuck, those things explode. And sprinted over there and picked them up, and you hear f- more footsteps coming that are going to be coming out of that door. Like as soon as your turn's over, throw them in the door. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, yeah, that <laughs> they might be able to disarm them. Yes, I'll throw them uh, through the doorway. All right, that's uh, not going to make a check. You just kind of <laughs> toss them through the door. <laughs> And, and scream okay. two down. Um, and then uh, I think I have one of those like attack move things. Move by action, yeah. Yeah, I'll you know move over to the, the side of the wall next to the door, so I'm not standing directly in front of it. All right, and that's it. Yep. And you're not going to get any type of issue, any type of commands or nothing, as our commanding officer. He shouted at a rabbit. Yeah. 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 <coughs> okay, I'm just checking. You must be doing right. I mean, they haven't hurt you so far, so. It's just been like someone heavily groping you in the back, but, you know, at a very small point. So, um. <laughs> what a, so basically, they're taking targeted lined up shots on your butthole. That's what the 20 was. <laughs> I keep the tail down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right in the dino sphincter. <laughs> that, hurt, that hurt worse than the foot. <laughs> That was only a 23, so... <laughs> That's going to take some healing. <laughs> so... <laughs> Something. Actually, this thing's covered in windows. I'll be like, hey, dog, just let that door go. Get in there. Because there's tons of windows and Revenant can take us to the floor. There's, there's, there's no lots point. of other ways out. There's no point in you getting standing there getting shot in the ass. Turn into a swarm of death chickens. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever he's not doing that well is <laughs> <laughs> But I want him to. I'm gonna make a character <laughs> who's death chicken whose only power is the ability to shoot chickens out of all of his <laughs> DIE! Chickens flying. Just normal chickens, but yeah, you can shoot. 
He just shoots them out in such quantity and at such speed they're lethal. <laughs> this main attack is frozen chicken cannon. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, God. So you have matter creation, matter creation, chicken, limited chicken only. <laughs> Ch- live chicken only. And then telekinesis, limited, only moving live chickens. <laughs> it's like uh, Squirrel all over again. <laughs> the... <clears throat> the building is on fire. Except I smell the fire in chickens. <laughs> except, <laughs> except, except you know, squirrel girl, you're salty chicken boy. <laughs> the, the people are starving. I give them lots of chickens. <laughs> you're immediately captured by the government and dissolved world hunger. <laughs> <laughs> They're released because they've had enough chicken. <laughs> they have so many chickens. They start flavoring your chickens. <laughs> We but can't have this Grand Canyon anymore. It's occupying too much space. I gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to smell for a while. Luckily, luckily, the Pepsi Corporation bought you, and now you work at KFC forever. <laughs> uh, why? Their profits skyrocket, and they take over the world. But the chickens exploded. The Ryan chicken was the villain. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> oh. uh, did you guys talk about food? Nope. We should do that, though. Yeah. Phoebe. Everything else. Ben, what do you want for food? Also, go get food. Shut <laughs> <laughs> <Chef> up, <Sal Boy. laughs> I don't know. I don't really have any strong references today. Oh. <laughs> one day, I offered! One day we need more of those uh, delicious chimichongas or whatever the fuck they were. It's a lot it's of or, or chili. Mm, yes. Basically, all, almost anything that Marissa cooks, honestly, I, I will eat like five servings. We know. I think the night was going to be like a good duplication off. of the micro raptor. I, I like stroganoff. And it only costs I'm not one point. Beef, so. <laughs> oh, yeah, he'll be, die. Yeah. It's like a <clears> duplication <throat> of very one. Awkward game. I need one more point to do I duplication. Like it. Make my final roll! But one! I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> Hold on, I'll, I'll reach in and I'll take it out. No, wait, that's right. But I don't face my life. Power of what I'm duplicating. <clears throat> Since my micro raptor's one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, food wise, what? Just pizza? Are we getting? I mean, I'm. I just ate, so I'm not. I don't know. I could eat again, I guess. <laughs> you just got eight, or you ate? <laughs> <laughs> it was awful pink. When what you did you eat? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh, Chipotle's <laughs> before the end, so I don't know. I, I'm I'm okay, but whatever. Um, pizza. Sure. Whatever. I'm just throwing stuff out here. I really don't care. I'm not like. I find out that as well. While we're talking about, I'm gonna use the restroom. Oh. Pizza, 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 pizza. All right. <coughs> Arby's. Arby's. We could do Arby's. Yeah. Since you're, if you're gonna drive out, we could do Arby's. Let's Arby's is doable, but yeah, it's only with coupons. They have sweet ass fish sandwiches. They do have sweet ass fish sandwiches. No, They're like literally the best fast food fish sandwich. If you guys want fish. Yeah, but I can't have beef. So I have to have chicken. Or fish. fish. No. I've had so much fish lately. <laughs> Religious thing? Boy, no. you're just feeding us lines now. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to want, just let it go. I tried to offer it up as a religious thing. He didn't take it. No, he goes, no. No, no. But, yeah, I'm just... I want some chicken today. Chicken or pizza? Those are the two things I will have. How about chicken pizza? I got chicken pizza. Is there a good coupon for Papa John's right now? <clears throat> or Pizza Hut? Do, do. Oh, I guess I can look. Okay. Well, you know, one of the five people that had the computer out would <coughs> be great. Oh, sir. Well, gee, I suppose I have access to one here, too. Or, or this one. <laughs> Papa John's No, no shortage of devices, certainly. And use the dice thing wrong. Um, forty percent off any menu at pet pizza price. Any regular? Me- that's good enough. Regular menu. It's yeah. It's this is the last day. It's good. 
Yep. The code is. I will take a forty percent off thin crust <coughs> pepperoni. What was decided on? I so think we're doing pizza, pizza Hut. Forty Pizza. Four zero P I Z Z A is the code. And Papa John's. At Papa John's. Oh. Or what did you? Is there another pizza that you thought? Pizza Hut's doing uh, seven ninety nine larges. That might work too. I, don't, I could go yeah, half a large. That's cheaper. I don't know. I don't. If that's whatever, I just want a half half pepperoni. That's all I want. Uh, I'll take a whole pepperoni. All right, that's eight for you, four for me. Does someone want to go half on a pizza? I'll do I half? All right, so me and Ben got one. Okay, so you're you doing uh, Pizza Hut? Okay. Pizza Hut's fine. I don't really care. I like Pizza Hut better than Papa John's, honestly, but not by a lot. So we're getting we got two pizzas. Do you guys do you want a pizza, James? Or you want something from Pizza Hut? Yeah, I'll get something from there. What do you want? Let me see what I got. I got some money. What is it? How much? Is it? Seven dollar? Eight dollars. Eight dollars. Large. I got eight dollars. All right. Ben, I got five for you. You can keep the change for so me. Just one topping. Just get out. So half a pepperoni for me. Twenty for me. Oh, this is just one toppings for eight bucks. Yeah, two topping. It's a two topping, or an extra three bucks for a specialty. I'll do sausage yeah. and mushroom then. If it's two toppings. Uh, let's see. Which store you want? The Main Street one. West Main Street. Yep. Well, shit. If it's two topping, I want a barbecue. I want barbecue sauce. Pineapple and chicken. And you want <laughs> Hawaiian. It's good stuff. Well, it's kind of Hawaiian. It doesn't have everything. It's, but, you know, two, two toppings. What do you want on it? Uh, for the sauce, barbecue. For the toppings, chicken and pineapple. Uh, thin crust. I'm hoping when these two guns explode in the hallway, they stop making the guns self-destruct right away. If it bites them a couple times. Right? Yeah. And what do you want? Pepperoni. You have a better spit on splitting them. Yeah, so. so uh, just make it Original double. pan? Sure. Double pep? Sure. Anything you would have said, he would have said sure to. Yeah. Kind you, of. You want thin crust, Ryan? For sure. I would, like, I would not like thin crust. So, no. Let's look at do half thin, half thin. No, just because you had thin crust last time. I have Ooh. no problem with alternating, but oh, thin that's crust fine. Whatever Ben time. wants, because I, as long as there's pepperoni on it and cheese and sauce, mm. I don't give a shit about the rest. Hand of it. Sauce, sausage, mushroom. I hold the D six of damage. I take it back. As long as there's no black. Ow! Rice. Holy shit! That really would do like a D six of damage. Yeah, it's solid. Yes, it is. <laughs> Herbs. Some people can figure that out only after only smacking me in the head once, folks. Nah, he's really hard-headed. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta eat the off. Don't want it, but I have to. <laughs> You're a dick. <laughs> no, I already told her that, too. I'm sure mm. there'll be extra pizza right now. Mm. Mm. Well, you both work, so... Mm. Do you cook mm. at all? Yeah, yeah see, then, then it's okay. I don't work, so I don't cook. Do you cook well? You don't work, so you don't cook. Yep. My wife work. My wife. <laughs> my wife's job is cooking, so it's like, who's the agreement? Ha, huh, you're gonna be a housewife. Okay, here's the shit you got to do. Okay. How'd that work out? Not well. <laughs> leggings. Lots of leggings. <laughs> I thought maybe that would work out for me. Like, are you going to be a house husband? No, she, she has to go for that. That's it, yeah. You don't make enough money for you to be a house husband. That's more of an idle rich thing. I don't make enough money for my wife to be a housewife. Well, you do. You still make well, enough to be a shopper and a housewife. Yeah. Uh, Dude, you're, you're well into the middle class. Yes, you don't I barely make enough to do... Housewife is expensive, and that's like... Literally, okay. If you were earning a shit job, we'd have an extra thirty thousand dollars a year in the account. 
I, I'm just saying. <coughs> I'm just saying yeah. that Has if you gone in, there was a uh, just about it. If there was a normal amount of you know just pleasure expenditure or whatever you want to call it, uh, you'd be fine. You'd be fine. You'd be better than fine. It's it's not normal to rocket through a few grand in leggings and shit in a month. Yeah. Oh well, I got my new computer. I got my 3D printer. I don't care at this point. Okay, so eight. Whose game is it under? Um, it'll be under mine. Okay. Yeah, yeah, really like me. I think we're going to. Uh, I'm going to pull up. I'm going to find the instructions and put them together again. Jam- what James had ordered. Well, they suck. The video instructions. <laughs> I don't know if you even had to use them. We no, I put mine together them. basically from how this is. I, I watched. I looked at one picture of how it went together and went. I can do that. I, 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 couldn't, I couldn't find anything, any visual aids except for these videos, and they suck. Super low resolution. Anyway, uh, and I'm just going to like read yours for the hardware. Uh, and just Because, you know, if I have to take my uh, heat bed off and take my servo motors out, I'm just like, is this going to actually be more work? Oh, my. Okay. <laughs> Lose, what did you order? I got a pizza? Well, because you said $25. Yeah, yeah, well, that's his five and my eight, so I get 12 back. Okay. If that's what you're asking. Okay. I'm not owed any money back, though, so I don't care. It's two. I gave him his change. Here's another five. What do you got? I have. Yeah. 33. I think it's 33 and change. So here's well, 33, yeah, okay. Uh, I'm not going to stress yeah, it. Sweet, sweet, sweet legal <laughs> currency. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 3346. 3346. What? The one at 21st Street on the West Main. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Well, please, on the Main Street. Don't ever hear it out of me. Oops. Oh. Down on Wing Street. <laughs> Down on Wing Street. Anyway, it's not what we used to say. Oh, no. You guys are getting old or something. Not on Let streaming. <laughs> We'd still just, we would still sing Down on Rape Street. It's just like it's not fitting the context right now. True. Anyway. <coughs> so, so I don't pizza is fucking ordered. You could, right. only do it, you could only do it in context the first time, and then you would segue into Rape Street. Every single time. That's kind of true. <laughs> Down on Rape Street! Anyway, moving on. So, yep, Patriot tosses the two guns <laughs> into the doorway. <laughs> clatter, clatter, clatter. They clatter to the floor of the f- as another one of those soldiers hops the two guns. He comes out. You're s- standing beside the door. So I'll see if he, he might know something like that. Uh, I'd say a 14 expertise tactics would probably yeah. tell him to clear the room. To check that side of the door first. Mm-hmm. So he immediately looks over, um, moves past you, and since there's no tax <laughs> opportunity in the system, he moves past you. Uh, turns around and fires. Okay. Uh, dodge a 16. Um, how's that work? There's a dodge number on your, the, the abilities column of your of dodge. dodge. There is. It works by you looking at where he's aiming and trying not to be there anymore. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's a DC 19 toughness save. I think. Let me make sure. 20. Sorry, DC 20. You guys watching the Ghost of the Shell trailer? Well, he didn't hit you with what he hit me with. Toughness. Uh, I made it. Um, he hit you with a critical. 23. 23? Uh, Pew! Okay, so... You basically, like, it hits you, but not anywhere where you give a shit. In the butt. The butt that everyone's always yeah, staring at. Well, it's the same game. arm. <laughs> or, like, or like, it hits your vest. Oh, and okay. it just, you know, yeah, it just, you know, smoke, you know. 
<coughs> it just compresses and doesn't do you cause you any damage because you're you're you know you're you. Yep, yep. He has that one spot on his arm that has armor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's I put all of my armor right here. <laughs> pew, 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 pew. It's like bikini last. She only had the bikini, but that's where every round hit her. All right, so the, se- and the second guy comes out of the door. He also hops the guns. Yep. Um, at this point, uh, I want you to make a check using your radios, your electric s- 20 sense stuff. 20. Um, you sense a an encrypted signal go out that is received by those guns. Okay. Ah. I recognize that signal. If I only had a way of broadcasting it. And then that guy fires on you. Alright. Um, dodge a 15. Okay, I did. When my little shields goes ping, you have to roll higher than an 18 to hit me. I have the pat... The, one of my powers is those shields. They give me. I don't roll the check. It's even, just even if they're copper jacketed. Oh, they're copper jacketed. It goes right through everything I have. I don't okay. have a dodge past that. So copper rounds. Okay, yeah. they go right into me. You don't well, have you a dodge, dodge. dodge. Why would I do that? On the first, the first round makes sense. You wouldn't even yeah. attempt to dodge. See, pink. Oh, fuck me. Uh, so DC nineteen. Mm. Okay, so I had to roll nineteen. So, so in fact nine. <laughs> All right. Actually, so let me let me double check. I actually I'm invincible. No, I'm not. <laughs> Let's see what my toughness is without my shield. I don't think it's very high. Um, my toughness is three normally, so I rolled a twelve. Okay. So then you failed by what did I say? Seven. Yeah. So a bruise and a daze. <laughs> Holy ballsack, Batman! That's. That's some real good realistic dialogue here, right? Anyway, that was nearly my everything. All right. Uh, that guy is knocked out. That guy is knocked out. Revenant. <sighs> Dart back up. Yeah, you're like, Whoa. okay. <laughs> Start this up again. Hmm. Yeah, more guys. Possess one of them. Easy 22 will. Uh, which, the one that, uh, so there's one that's engaged, has. Is aiming at him because they're kind of in opposite, pointing in opposite directions. The one aiming at him or aiming at him? Aiming at him, I guess. Because he's right. like, at this point, recoiling in pain. That's true. Mm. Oop, that's Dark Force sheet. You don't, that's not the right one. Oh. Um, okay. Um, nope, you got an 18, so. All right, so I've got him. Just, just like... Uh, Compel him <coughs> to feel like a traitor and betray his uh, his uh, fellow, you know, special forces guys. Okay, that is all. <laughs> You've been wrong okay. all this time. Those guys must not be the terrorists that we were told where they were. But the money feels so right. I'm conflicted. <laughs> um, he, it'll then be on his turn. Doctor <laughs> Euteratops. I will. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna drop the door. All right. Per my command. <laughs> it slams down. And uh, shift to the raptor and go to engage. Okay. And that'll be it, cause it's an action to do that. Uh, it's free, but I'm figuring unshifting and shifting should at least take something. Backing out of the door on shift. Yeah. shift. Drop, right. shift, move. That's that's the equivalent of what'll fit in the comic panel. So yeah, yeah. that makes sense. Mark Force, you just got the shit shot out of you. Okay, well my response to almost everything is to shoot it with lightning, so I'm gonna shoot the guy with lightning. So dazed is single standard action. Okay. So Last you are able to do I was that. propping the stupid green shit up with. I put it over there because I was walking through there. Sorry, we can't touch anything in this wall. I have lightning bolt them. 18 plus. I hit that guy, the guy next to him on the lightning stream, so 26. What, what is he dodging? What is he dodging? 26. Wow. The lightning. Okay. That's plus 8. I rolled an 18. Alright. Uh, so you hit that guy, and the next one. What's the jump range? Is it like super far? I think it's like 25 feet. 
they would be in that. In that so. um, yeah. Okay. This is my minion buster attack. Oh, that's exactly what <laughs> just happened. <laughs> it only jumps once though, so it's not like it. Like if you bring it like four at once, it'd be two and then two. So as that guy falls down, I'm ah. standing there immaterially in the same position he was. Are well, we? that was pointless. We have got to be. You know, there's got to be some kind of feedback on that, isn't there? If you were inside of him when he took it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I don't know. I'm immaterial still. Does it? Did you take the uh, add-on effects immaterial mm. or intangible? Mm-mm. Yeah, I'm commanding. I can't like read his mind. There's no back. There's no back feed to feedback. Right, but like the other one, you were feeling. Yeah, yeah. I can physically feel with my fingertips. But wouldn't you physically feel an electrical shock? I might feel it, but at the same time, I'm still immaterial. Oh. I'm just trying to go by the rules of the game. Yeah. Is it mind control? Yes. Did you buy a specific limitation that would... Um, <coughs> what limitations do you have on it? Uh, range. It's touch range. I guess technically I could go like this. I'm mind controlling. I'm mind controlling. <laughs> but, you know. Control... So you can impose your will on others, forcing them to resist. Targets failing a will resistance check against your effect, your effect DC become dazed, then compelled as they try to fight off your influence. Finally, with three or more degrees of effect, the target becomes controlled and obeys the commands you give. Degrees of failure are cumulative. So basically, we try to mind control, they have to immediately fail three levels, or they just sit there and go while he tries to take control of their mind. Okay. That wasn't really the question. But, but um, according to this, if he's got a range of touch, if my attack affected him normally, it should affect him. Since it doesn't affect him normally, then it shouldn't do shit. Okay. <coughs> well, if that's the case, then he does. Then he, he didn't fail by three degrees. But he's dead. He, so he's been dazed the whole time. For the two seconds he's been. <laughs> first degree is yeah. dazed, then compelled, then controlled. Yeah. So he was dazed. So he's well, compelled is he, he failed by two, so he get compelled. Yeah, which which, which allowed us to put in the command of your traitor now. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, he, that's fair. Yeah. So okay, uh, so those two guys fall to the ground. And again, standing there, same way pose he was in. Well, that was pointless. <coughs> oh, motherfucking fucker! Are we still around time? Just a second. Yeah. So, momentary break from combat. Um, you guys kind of collect yourselves as the four guys have fallen. The woman's still over there, screaming with her leg caught in the door. Well, I'll go for her. Stop. Okay, sorry. I'm just describing the scene. She's still caught over there. Um, the four guys lay on the floor. Uh, so there's you four in the lobby. The four go- guys that have gone down. The two that you just dropped have the glowing rifles. Yeah, they fall down. The lights are blinking on the guns again. <coughs> because of course they are. And uh, well, actually, yeah. So we'll just continue with that at this point because those things are still in play. Now the first step is Revenant. Okay. I'll just zip over to her, phase her right out. It's like, sorry about this, ma'am. I, I don't know uh, why those guys were so hostile. Let's see if I, can get, if I can go through the blast shields or whatever. I'll just phase her outside. Um, yeah, there, there's not any electronic, electro force fields or anything. Mm-hmm. And this, they're just... You do notice that the gates are very... They're very well. It almost looks like they're mold. It's a mold, not like they're bars like welded to grates. Mm-hmm. Like it's a solid piece. Hmm. That's interesting. Yeah, but pass through them. You know, just like steadier. Can you walk? Yeah, 
<laughs> oh, okay. Let me go. Let me go. Help. She starts screaming. Give me your terrace. <laughs> really? Yep. Really? It's true. We just electrocuted like a black faced guy. Oh, hold on, hold on. I'm thinking in character. Floating backwards, really? Disappearing through the wall. Alright. Really? Utah. While floating away, remove the ankle bone. (laughs) 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 And liver. (laughs) Slap her in the face with her own liver. (laughs) (laughs) Smack (laughs) her. I, 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 show, I put it in backwards. <laughs> now when she drinks, she gets extra dry. <laughs> it filters nothing. <laughs> okay, so that happened. Or it didn't. I'm not sure. Um, hey, Blake! There's a lot of stuff going on. <laughs> this yeah. morning. Sound effects. Production value. <laughs> We pay extra to have children run around and jump on the floor <laughs> during combat scenes. Hey, you know, we other pay. channels might do their stiff shit, shitty and crappy, but we really have practical physical effects. No CGI here. <laughs> you know, James, he's really like a sixty-five pound guy, but we have him CG. No. I'm in a puppet suit. <laughs> <laughs> he's really Martin Lawrence in a fat suit. Okay, so. Uh, there's Ron's house. There's two guns that are blinking on the ground. Yes. I'm a raptor, so I can't do anything about that. <laughs> <laughs> you can eat them. Oh, there's a raptor. Yeah. You, can, you can turn it into a triceratops. Based on how much damage they did last time, not as in anything. Yeah. Um. Because they did more than. Uh, I'm going PLA to. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to head over near the door where they were coming out of. All right. And then attack one if one comes out the door. That's fair. And then hope that nothing explodes up my ass. All right. (laughs) Mark Force. I am on my hands and knees in the ground, like vomiting up pools of electricity. What I'm doing this round is I'm switching one of my powers from my shield to my regeneration ability. Which still takes more than a round to recover, but you start to see the bullet start extruding out of my chest as I'm going. Hur! Hur! All right, I look very heroic right now. So, what is your regeneration? What? How fast is that? One point. Sure. It's one bruise per one point two five rounds. So, so every one and a quarter rounds you heal. Yeah. So, like the first round I don't heal, and then the next four rounds in a row I do heal. That's the easiest way to do it. Okay. Yeah. So, this round I'm not healing. I'm just going... <laughs> put my crawling over to a floor outlet. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, I got rid of that floor outlet thing because it doesn't make sense in Pathfinder. So, it just... I, it Pathfinder? Does a slight, or not Pathfinder. Um, means yes. of Mastermind. So. But, yes, yeah, so I'm kind of just on the ground on my hands and knees hawking and looking miserable. You got rid of the source part of the thing. Yeah. Okay. Was, there was... It didn't make sense in this system. Okay. It totally makes sense to the system. Mm. Not made a game though. All right, so <laughs> well, <laughs> so you're doing that, yeah. Patriot. I still some guns lay on the floor there. <laughs> Doctor Utah's by the open door. Yeah, there's more people laying on the ground. Uh, you could go save the woman, the one you could actually have saved and done something. Oh wait, she's gone. That door's closed. Yeah. Probably should have done that. You just talked me out of it. I didn't talk you out of nothing. James, I blame James. Sure, I'm the GM. I'll take that blame. I stopped listening to him. All right. Um, easier than Death House. Yeah. We don't know yet. These guns haven't exploded. We don't know if they are going to explode. We don't. You really want to find out? I would communicate, but. <laughs> How are you doing, Patriot? Uh, no more bad guys? None seem to be around. Um, Ruben's shooting out my side. I'll go uh, plates down the hallway they came from. 
What will I see? Well, first, the first thing you see is a big raptor butt. As you pass that, yes. <laughs> raptor butt, raptor butt. Remember, his weak spot is his anus. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you go inside. Uh, you looking at you like fully going through the door and everything, or yeah, I'll, I'll step through the door and you know, okay. Because you're right, fast. make sure there's you know not another group of guys running up on us. Forty-seven of them shooting you in the face. Yeah. All right. Uh, you see a security office. Uh, you see a, a gun rack on the wall that seems to be empty. Yep. Yeah. Uh, cameras, monitors, stuff like that. You see a uh, uh, emergency, like label emergency switch, red switch that's been it's it's flashing. Oh, well, they set off an alarm, but I don't think there's any more of them here. And uh, since there's not a reflex save, make a this would be a dodge. Oh wow! Say, I don't think there's any more of them. Wow. <laughs> Uh, ten. Okay. Um, another one of those gates goes, <laughs> and you're in that room. Okay. Hmm. Well, now I'm stuck in here. All right. So this point, so you see the door go. Flank it. You're like, oh, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, ha huh, ha. Huh. Nobody. All right. And, uh, okay, so you three are out in the main hall. Yeah. Um, well, you're, did you go back in? I'm just on the inside of the uh, blast door. Okay. <coughs> so you, from those, the top of the ceiling is a really, it's, it, this is an older building, so it's got the really nice ceiling where it's, you know, got, you know, nice woodwork and, and, and paintings and stuff in, in between the, the arches and things like that. Mm -hmm. Um, you see, see from vents in the ceiling, bugs start pouring out. What does? Bugs. All kinds of different insects start pouring out of this, and they start. Fuck. They're like covering the ceiling, and they're coming down the back. They're coming down like the side walls, and they're coming down those that all that glass, and like the light is dimming. Oh, that's horrifying. Sure glad I'm not in a tight and closed space with vents, because otherwise they'll be able to fill an entire room up. So they start coming to the wall, and they, they start coalescing, like, in front of the main door. Like, a, a pile of them starts moving up, like, coalescing. Shame. They turn into supervillain number one. An actual supervillain. Oh, my God. And this is the best thing I could find. <laughs> <laughs> Some crazy guy so, who so covered himself in bees. This person, this, this humanoid form, kind of comes up into into form, and it says, "We are angry. You have come into our city." Hey, it's the new mayor. Right, right. We will stop. <laughs> we, we will stop you. We will try and make you one of us. And then you say that line you just said, Mouse. It kind of looks over you and it goes, it just goes, <laughs> it kind of roars. And a whole stream of bugs goes out towards you. Well, and they just, you're still immaterial, so they just go, they go, <laughs> and just cover the whole wall behind where you were, are coming out. Uh-huh. Um, but here's but you yeah. can act you can f as they're walking through you, um, make a will save. Ooh, I have to make a will save, huh? Eighteen plus stuff. Okay. Uh, twenty three. You feel a very small it, not small is the wrong word. A very a weak force trying to sort of kind of take control of get you like how you take control of people. Oh, great. <laughs> hey guys, they do what I do with the brain. But it's it's way it's like it's like it's 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 it's, it's like a kid tugging at your shoulder like, "Hey, can you do this stuff for me?" 
Oh, that's so it's it's very it's very weak comparatively. Mm -hmm. uh, but it, but you do notice it's there. Um, okay, so we need force fields on you, and um, I don't know how to kill these things, but we need to. Well, I've got some possible options, and before we start up with them, we'll call that for this uh, this part of Mutants and Masterminds because our food just arrived here, and it's almost six o'clock. Oh. I Next week will be the your first uh, major battle with a Actually, true super villain. Yay. super villain type person. It's going to be Swarm because it can't be called you can't be called anything but Swarm, but not Marvel Swarm, who is identical but not the same, and not Hive because that's also a Marvel villain name. Yeah, basically every name's been taken. Yeah. Copyright. So anyway, any PowerPoint start journal? Thanks for watching Mutants and Masterminds. Stay with us. We'll be. Uh, back in a little bit and we'll be playing uh finish it up we be kobolds with nick as our gm we be kobolds, yes nick as the gm gm oh. produce us on break let us know so we can leave before we go hmm i'm gonna be shooting electro shotguns at things <laughs>